Hey guys, what is up? This is Nathan, and welcome back finally to another episode of Let's Play Harvest Moon Animal Parade. So anyway, uh, continuing on with the week from before, we actually got a pretty huge harvest. As you can see, this entire field of flowers plus our 100 field of buckwheat was ready. Okay, let me just see the baby here. She is so cute, isn't she? Little Rose, she's absolutely adorable. I love her. Oh, good little baby Rose. Good little baby Rose. That's what the wife says when you talk to her with the baby. Oh, a baby. Can I see the baby? I won't do anything. You're suspicious? Wait, what's that supposed to imply? Like the witch is going to steal your baby or something? That's weird. Good baby. Okay, let's see what's out here. Oh, it's the mayor. Hey, mayor, how you doing? Hi there, Nat, how are you? Oh, yeah, I'm pretty good. Yeah, yeah, whatever. I want to talk to you about the New Year's Festival. Okay, tell me about it. The New Year's Festival is an opportunity to reflect. Oh, boy. You can also decide on your goals for the next year. That's the countdown. There's a countdown event at Clock Tower in Harmonica Town. Sweet. It's best to come with a special someone, like my wife. I hope you enjoy the New Year's Festival. Okay, thanks. All right. Yeah. New Year's Festival! Okay, we have got a lot of money from shipping everything, and so we need to do some shopping. So let's buy some stuff. First off, in the carpenters, what do we got here? We got so much money and so much material that we should upgrade something. Okay, house number four takes 600. Look at that, we are literally four lumber short. I could cut down one tree and have enough to increase the house size. But that's not really necessary. The house is already so big. I mean, we don't need it bigger. You only have to have it bigger if you want a bigger pet. We could increase our barn size or our coop size and then get... Um, if we increase our coop size, we could get uh, silkworms. Or we could get the watermill, actually. Okay, you know what? We're getting the coop. That's what we're doing. You know what else? We got so much money, I don't even care anymore. We're getting the barn, too. Yeah, I said it. What are you going to do about it? In fact, you know what? I'm feeling real crazy. I'm feeling real crazy. How about... No, well... You know what? Yeah. Yeah, what the heck? We're getting the water mill, too. Yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I want to do this. Yeah, we're getting the water mill. What are you going to do about it? That's what I thought. Okay, onward. A little more shopping we need to do here. Almost done. But let's go into the general store. And got to pick up a special item to use with our baby. And that would be... The baby rattle. Yeah. It's like a toy. It, you use it on your baby. Like it, It's like almost like a brush for a cow. But you use it on your baby. It makes them, uh, makes, raises their affection. Let's see. Any new makers here? Nope. Just the mayonnaise maker. Do I want to get the mayonnaise maker? Uh, no. No, I don't think so. You know, I don't really need a mayonnaise maker. Yeah, rattle was added. Let's go. And one more stop to make is all we've got. We're going to go into the jewelry shop here. Because I collected some gems the other day, or some wonderfuls that I still haven't had refined. So, let's refine this yellow wonderful first. At a 14. 14, how many we get? Glass 10, oh boy. Amber 2. And Topaz 2. Okay, that's cool. Whatever. I'm happy. I'm not complaining. Yeah, let me refine something else. Let's refine. We only got two uh, white wonderfuls to refine. Glass. And, ooh, a diamond. Very valuable. Very valuable, very useful. Yeah, I think I'm pleased with that. Okay, so let's do a little bit of shopping while we're on the while we're spending money, blowing it anyway. While we're spending like Congress, let's go ahead and get a little bit more stuff here. At the animal place, we might as well get some more feed for the chickens. It doesn't help to just get a lot to stay ahead. I think we're getting a little bit low. So you know, it's never a bad idea to just stock up on feed whenever you feel like it. Um yeah, let's get a couple of sets of 99. Why not? What the heck? And uh, what animals can we get here? Let's see, we increased the size of our barn. 
so we can hold more. Um, let's get... Um, oh yeah, well, let's try a goat. Yeah, let's do a goat. And it won't let us. You can only have three types of animals in your barn at once. Since we already have sheep, cows, and horses, we'd have to get one of those again. That's kind of frustrating. I don't like that about the game. But, I don't know, I guess it does keep things simpler. Okay, so let's get a sheep. Sheep are pretty good uh, money makers. And what should I name the sheep? Something interesting like Spartacus. Yeah, let's do Spartacus. That's a good name for a sheep. P-A... R... Let's see, Spartacus is not going to fit, so we will do something like... Spartina. There we go, Spartina. That's a good name for it, since it is, I mean... I want to assume it's a female anyway, we are getting milk from it. If it wasn't, that'd just be weird. Okay, do they have any... We should be able to get some, um... Silkworms now too, but maybe not yet. Maybe not till we get the notice letting us know that we can get silkworms. Or I guess we haven't gotten the notice yet, because I'm not seeing them on the list here. No, it's gonna make us wait before we can actually get silkworms. Uh, whatever. Okay, let's check out our new sheep here. Oh, there she is, Spartina. Isn't she cute? She's adorable, isn't she? Let's give her some food. Good girl, Spartina. Oh, who's a good sheepy? Oh, you're a good sheepy. Yes, you are. Yes, you are a good sheep. Oh, good girl. Let's see. Get out the brush. Oh, good girl. Yeah. I'll brush you to make you love me. And now I'll clip you to make you hate me. Oh, that's the thing I don't like about these games, is shearing your sheep does make them angry. I don't know, I wonder if it actually... I don't know. I don't know if sheep have any opinion at all on being sheared. Anyway. Let me show you guys the uh, coop while we're at it. Yeah, so we hold the exact same number of poultry in here. Uh, but these boxes right here in the middle, that's where silkworms will go when we eventually get them. When we're allowed to get them. Oh, and I walked in on this cutscene. Um, yeah, apparently I got Anissa and Jen up to a high enough uh, affection level. Are you okay? How does it feel now that the tables have turned and you're the one with the cold? Ha <laughs> ha! Well, I enjoy being cared for, but your medicine's a bit... sour. <laughs> oh, I made a lot of soup. Please have some later. Is there anything else I can do for you? <laughs> I'm laughing at you. Laugh at the sick person, everyone. No, I'm okay. You seem to be enjoying this. Huh. It's rare to be able to take care of a doctor. Ah. Oh. Your fever's gone down, so I'll be heading home now. Please, get some rest, though. Uh, could you hold on a second? What is it? I'd like to have you come by here again to help. Oh, that's so sweet. Sure thing, I'll be back again tomorrow. No, I mean... I want you to stop by here again and again from this point on- Oh no, he didn't! Oh... I guess that's like a marriage proposal, or the closest thing to it. Jen's getting married! You dog, you. Okay, um, one thing I forgot to show you guys when I was showing you the barn and the coop was the water mill. Now, if you check the sign here, we can now mill uh, everything, actually. You know, before we had the water mill and the windmill in flute fields, and you can only mill certain things in different ones, but now with this we can mill, I think it's everything in the game. So I saved a little rock salt just to show you guys how it works. Put a little rock salt in, and we get salt out. Neat, huh? That's fun. Let's do it again. Rock salt in. Salt come out. Okay, got a few letters here. Let's check it out. Wedding invitation. Please join us for our joyous occasion on the day 15 of spring at 10 o'clock. Okay, guys, I'm really going to try to remember this one. I'm sorry I missed Toby and Renee. Help me. Scream at me through the comments, like right before this wedding. Okay, got a thread maker. 
uh, ostrich incubator. We can get ostriches. Ah, now we can get silkworms. Now the next day afterwards, wh whatever. Whatever, yeah. Anyway, it is Saturday, so it's the last day, and, uh, what? What? Why are there rocks in my field? You know what? This doesn't even make sense. Whatever, I don't, I don't even care anymore. I know those don't grow there. I don't even care. Whatever. Oh, yeah. I did not fertilize this field yet, so the flowers have not all grown. Yeah, it's a little disappointing. Oh, it's a beautiful day. We're going to go to the New Year's Festival here. There's my wife of... Um... Hey, honey. Where's the baby? No, seriously, where's the baby? What'd you do? Okay, baby is okay. No serious problems, but we are going to go ahead and go to the New Year's Festival. So let's get our wife. Let's get little Rose here. And we will head out. Okay, coming up on the New Year's Festival now. Coming into town. Ooh, that's pretty, all lit up like that. Oh, such a pretty place. It's time for the New Year's Festival! Ha! Ah, we'll be having a mining contest to determine your mining skills. And you pack, you pack rats, we got a foraging contest. Finally, the fashion contest ends the year in style. Ha ha ha! Uh huh. Well, we're gonna enter some fun contests and hang out here. That'll be fun. Oh, look, and there's Simon. You know, we need we need a family picture. Yeah. Oh, very cute. Looks like the two of you. Yep. Usually that's how it works with babies. Yeah. Give us a picture with the family, huh? Oh, that's a good place for a picture, right there in front of the clock tower. Say cheese! <laughs> and Vivi does that very Japanese, you know, Japanese woman pose where she holds her arm across her torso and grabs her other arm, whatever. Okay, let's see what's going on here. We can buy, ooh, we can buy clothes here. And this is where you get all, like, the crazy clothes you can't get the rest of the year. Aloha outfit, pop outfit. Some of these just are not very interesting to me. Animal... a cat costume? Okay, camo clothes. Rabbit ears. Cat ears. Oh my gosh, what is wrong with you, Japan? You, you guys are not normal. Okay, don't want anything there. What do you got? You got herb seeds. Every type of herb. Well, good for you. And what have you got? You've got, uh, okay, like cooking utensils. But like special, like chic and luxury. I don't think you can buy that normally. Okay, whatever. Hey, Ramsey. How you doing, buddy? Hey! Oh, you brought your kid along. Looks like a smart kid. Sure heck is. That's right. Don't you forget it. And down here... Yeah, there's not anything down here. Okay, come on, Vivi. Let's go. I say we try entering some contests. What's up, Mir? Hi oh, there! So you came with your child? Yeah, something... Let me enter a contest. Right, let's start off with a fashion contest. I want to get my fashion on. Well, now begin the fashion contest. Participants Luna, Candace, Myra, Kathy, Maya, and Nat. Oh man, let's check it out here. Luna! Heart, or love that heart, music note. Look at that. Oh, look at that girl, she got style. Yeah. You go, girl. Candace. Yeah. Look at that girl. Look at that girl, she's got the sweater look. And the plaid, I love the plaid, it's beautiful. Beautiful. Okay, Myra. Yeah. I like that look. That look totally says I'm middle-aged and not interested in anyone. All right, I love it. Uh, Nat, here we go. Oh, yeah. Here I am. Look at my style. I got the threads, baby. That's right. Oh, yeah. Check it out. 
Okay, the judges are... Wait a second. One of the judges has two granddaughters in this contest. I think this is a fix. Oh, whatever. Oh, what did I tell you? Fix. Fix. First and second place were her grandchildren. Oh. I got... Hey, I beat Myra. All right. <laughs> Sorry, Myra. Okay. And you're just getting, like, various um, yarn products. And that's it for this year's fashion contest. Make sure to improve your fashion. You know what? My fashion don't need no improving. I am a fashion trendsetter. Whatever. Let's try another contest. See what we can do. Okay, yeah. Uh, you should enter at least one contest. I already did, but let's enter another one, shall we? Let's do the foraging contest. We'll now begin the foraging contest. The participants are Barbara, Simon, Bo, Owen, Palo, and Nat. And why are two of the judges under eight years old? That's what I don't understand. I'm confused about... Okay, whatever. Anyway. Now to announce the winner, it is... Come on. Oh yeah, that is me. I have forged more things than anyone else, I guess. Owen, then Palo. Yeah, Simon, you suck. All right. 600 pieces of lumber. That is an awesome prize. That is like the best prize given away in the entire game. I am so okay with that. That's it for this year's foraging contest. Okay, and I think the way that the uh, gym contest is you actually have to have the gym with you, which I don't. So whatever. All right, just burning a little bit of time here. Up, oh, time to start the festival. 2300, almost time for the countdown. Well, I guess we've already started the festival, but we're going to start the countdown now. Countdown to New Year's. Now, this is interesting the way they do it, because in the old Harvest Moon games, it was never midnight. It was you go to see the first sunrise together. There was no countdown, no waiting to midnight thing. I don't know, I kind of like that tradition better. It's more unique. It's kind of special. But whatever, this is cool. How is everyone's year? Eh, it's okay. A new year is upon us. Let's think of a goal to set for next year. A goal, eh? I don't have one. You? I am going to say happiness with Vivi, because that will raise her affection, if you say that. That's not a goal at all. That's just how things are. Aww. But yes, let's work together. My friendship level with Vivi improved greatly. Sweet! Yes, score! That's how it works, guys. All right, it's about that time. Let's start the countdown. Five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> Simon's like panicking. Zero. Woo! It's New Year's. We're all happy. Happy New Year. Let's make it a great one. All right. Okay, guys, that's going to be it for this episode. Um... Yeah, we've had a very, very good year. Um, got married, beat the game. We'll keep going for at least a little while longer. Guys, thanks a whole lot for watching. Please have a good new year yourself, and until the new year, stay frosty. It is such a good